Randy, uh, the players and you had said you wanted a performance to be proud of. Clearly, you know, mission accomplished there. What do you take from, from this game? Well, again, it's uh, it's one where, you know, the message is, is now that you've been able to prove to us that you you can play a game that we needed to play, that we have to play a style that we have to play with the commitment to the little things in the game, that now our expectations are to carry that on to the next one. And for us to, to recognize that there are certain things that we've been doing out there that were much a big or a drastic difference tonight than what we were on Saturday night and the night maybe the night before that. So again, it's just a recognition of uh, how hard it is and how, how easy it can be if we stick to a game plan. Now the easy part is is because we were able to do it one night doesn't mean the next night's going to be easy. You know, we know that we're going to have to play it, uh, as we go forward to a higher level than we did tonight. It just that tonight everything fell our, our way and we'll take it because we were in drastic need of a performance at home. Is there a nervous time in that game when you're absolutely dominating but, but not scoring? Oh, uh, for sure. When it's nothing, nothing. And I think we had to take, we had our 27th shot before we scored. So those are nervous times because you, you know that sometimes fate and sports comes and bites you the wrong way and and that was what we were worried about that'll that'll that's what will question you'll question that all the time they talked about being smarter with the puck is that something you stressed well we stress that when we've believe me it's not the first time we've stressed it you know this is game what it nine for us eight nine you know and we've stressed that right from the beginning of the year but it just seemed that in some of the situations that we've been in that we haven't committed ourselves or co haven't committed to what the team needs you to do to have success. Did, Did you like the, the new uh, line combination? Yes. Do you think that worked? Yeah. I think it, you know, for some looking at it, offensive zone time and shots and the way our, our club played it, you know, I thought the line came, combinations were a bonus. You know, it was Bozak scored, Van Riemsdijk scored. You know, they were, you know, opportunistic. Phil scored, a, you know, a goal scorer's goal from behind the net. You know, that's the kind of stuff that, that you're, you look for and you, you need that. We need that in the, in the situation that we're in. You see a step forward for the power play? Well, we had lots of offensive zone time. I still don't think we shot the puck enough. I think that, that we vacated the front of the net when we had opportunities to shoot the puck and we, we let never see a lot of pucks on the power play. And it'll be something we'll continue to work on. And as I stated, I think it was this morning, talking about the power play, that we have four staples like everybody else does too, and that we have to establish that shot. You have to have net presence. You have to have puck recovery. And our work ethic has to be one where you're going to outwork the penalty killing unit you're playing against. Was Dion OK after that collision there? Yeah. Yeah, I was surprised that, that, that uh, he didn't have any, he wasn't any worse for wear. Little little bit of a, a pop in his hip, and he was right back. It looked a lot worse. I to tell you the truth, on those on the replay when I saw it in between periods, I said, "Holy crow, what's this?" Thanks, coach. All right.